gorgeous ladies and gentlemen of the realm, Fairy Vixen here, back on your Thursday evening. If you see something you can't live without, please do leave a timestamp in the comments below of the item in which you're interested. Or if you would rather, you could send that same information to my email, which is in my description. But if you do that, please include the title of the video, the date that it was posted, a short description of the item, the timestamp, and the price quoted. That way I'm guaranteed to find the exact item that you would like. And if you haven't bought from me before, include your name, address, PayPal, email, and YouTube name. Uh, that way I can match up your names, get your items invoiced, and get them out to you. Um, I invoice on the first of the month, or $50, whichever comes first. Uh, so if you don't see your item, or your, eh, if you don't see your invoice right away, that would be why. All right, without further diddling about, let's grab some more stuff. This is Cat's Eye and trying to figure out that stone. It almost looks like aquamarine. Or it could be Amazonite. Yeah, I'm, gonna, I'm leaning toward Amazonite. Just from the color, it's looking a little more green. Alrighty, that I'm gonna do for two. Here is a dyed howlite. Wait, nope, magnesite. Dyed magnesite. You can tell because this is brown. Yeah, it's got brown inclusions, not gray. So, this is nice. This is a nice piece. It's got hardly any inclusions in it. So, we're going to do that for five. Ooh, you're pretty. Hold on, hold on. We got stuff. We got stuff tangled up. Tangle, tangle, mango, tangle. Oh, it's because this is magnetic. Beautiful red enamel with a little bit of sparkle in there. And it's got really, really strong magnet. Let's see how big. How big are you? Two and a half. It's two and a half round. So that's, you know. It's me with a bunch of room. So, yeah, that's really pretty. I'm going to do that for five. Fire, fire. This one is from Claire's. And it's uh, still on the card. Marked down from $6.99 to 2 it's a little ballerina bunny with a little tutu. She's so cute. We'll do her for a dollar. Whoa, okay. You are another lariat style. Like this, like this with tassels. And this part up here is suede. It's not faux suede, it's real. Wait, is it? No, it might be faux. But that's an interesting one. I like the uh, centerpiece. That's really cute. Let's do that for four. <laughs> And there I go with that dang song again. For days, it's in your head. For days. This is gunmetal and burgundy. With some pink. And some... What color is that? Some like light amber. They're all... Hmm. They're all glass. Yeah, all glass, except for the pearls. The pearls are 
UFO with their glass pearls. That's really pretty. It's a two strand. Two strand choker and it's very um vintage styled, I would say. It's not vintage, but it's styled vintage Lee. <laughs> I don't know. Gunmetal. For some reason, gunmetal and, uh... Oh, come on. Why you do this? Gunmetal and burgundy always look really nice together. We're going to do that one for five. All glass. This is a bracelet with a toggle. And mother of pearl and silver tone and black. I don't know what the black is. Eh, black is plastic. That is mother of pearl. And the rest is silver tone with little little O's. That's kind of cute. Do that for three. Oops, oops, oops. Silver tone and blue. Uh, handmade, it looks like. It's got a big. <laughs> okay, this cracks me up. This, this large. Uh, spring ring and this is very lightweight plastic that would be beautiful on some nice heavy stone beads because it's you know it's hefty <laughs> I'm sorry I, I don't mean to laugh at somebody's handiwork but and these are like from a, a key ring these split rings Okie dokie, we're going to do that for just for this clasp. If you are a crafter, I'm going to do this whole thing for three because that is worth $3. Sell it for the elements, yo. Ooh, sparkly. Glass, these are all glass. And it goes, let's see, one, two, three. Eh. Eh. Come on, quit, quit flipping around. Liberty gibbet. Okay, one, two, three, four, five rings. And two of them on one end. Oh, three of them. Oh, they all have it. Okay, they all have a gold tone piece. Staggered. But these peach beads are beautiful. They don't even all look the same color. I think it's like a shift. It's got like a shift. And it's got one on the end. That's stunning. I love these beads. Ugh. They're really different. Ooh, I'm going to do that for six, I guess. Oh, excuse me. Didn't mean to bump you. These are blue and white. They look like uh it's got a hook. Let's see. Eee, unhook. Let's see. This looks like it was made with um you know those Things you put in the bottom of your uh, vases with the flat backs on them. That's really pretty. I don't know who made it, but it's really nice. Here, let's put the hook through the right place. There you go. Oh, that's so pretty. Do that for four. 
Actually, no, we'll do it for five. Look at the look at the detail on there. Nice wire work. Very cool. And I think the links are handmade too. Really cool. Five for that. Five for that. Here's some more of those uh, glass earrings for a buck. This is... What? Oh. That is fake as fake can be. It's supposed to look like a toggle in the front, but it's not. It's static. It's got a jewel on the end. Oh, that's hilarious. <laughs> that's so funny. I'll do it for three. <laughs> Here is a brass ball chain for your brass pendants. Man, these kind of chains have been around since what, like the 20s, I think. <laughs> Dollar for that. I used to have somebody that bought all of my, all of my, eh, no, do not, um, ball chains. I don't remember whatever happened to her. She disappeared. Like you do, you know, things, people come and go. I really do appreciate, okay, that came off of something. Appreciate those of you that are still here. Those of you that are new, I have noticed that I've gotten quite a few new people recently. So I want to say hello and thank you. And this is Beautiful Stone. many much kinds of stone it is stretchy so if you want to put it around your wrist and wear it that way which is what i would probably do very cool uh or you can wear it as a necklace because it's nice and long it's like in 24 30 maybe 34, okay, 34 inches long. That I'm gonna do for seven, because that's really cool. All righty, we have, what in tarnation do we have? Travel. Uh, it just says travel on it. I take it as supposed to be some ancient place. If anybody's familiar with that imagery, let me know. I'm gonna do it for three. It's kind of different. No, 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 no. flat as I'll get out. This is a choker with an old-fashioned clasp and some grapes with grape leaves. And these are plastic. It's cute though. That almost looks like I think that's silver plated. Yeah. There's your wine drinking necklace. <laughs> Two for that. 
This one is interesting. It is the Capitol building with red and white. Pearls and rhinestones. That looks like a 50s or 60s um, souvenir piece from Washington, D.C. And it's a little bit caught up. The, um, the jump ring that's the bail is jammed in this spot here. Do I have something I can pick it out of there with? Hold on a moment. There we go. Got it. <laughs> Yay. Fixed. And it's very short. So it's, you know, well, I don't know. It looks like 18 inches maybe. Maybe. Yeah, 18 inches. That's not bad. So, if you want to show your uh, patriotism for the way that our government works, you can wear that. Well, I don't know that it works anymore, but <laughs> it's debatable. Oh, look at this. Now, what? Did I even give you a price on that? I'll give you that for three. This is cute. It's uh, angel dust. I mean, angel dust. Fairy dust. i.e. Uh, iridescent glitter <laughs> in a heart. Very cute. It's like pinkish, greenish. You can't really see the... But now you can. There you go. We're going to do that for two. Alex and Ani for five. Notre Dame. And this is one of those there. I had another one that was uh, all brass beads. This looks like silver tone, copper tone, and brass. It's got a bunch of different tones, but it's real heavy. It's like cute little cube beads. Those would be nice in between, in between something else. I would be dis deconstructing that sucker. And it's from Premier Designs. We'll do it for four. Premier, Premier. Damn, that song is still stuck in my head. Yeah. <sighs> Sometimes stuff gets stuck, you know what I'm saying? All right, let's flip this around. Around. It is dyed. No, it is not dyed halite. It is made to look like that dyed halite. It is a uh, a resin. The orange part, and then there's these little. These guys need to be re uh, reconfigured. So we have a little a little drop, and then we have chain. So it's a drop, and a chain, and a drop, and the chains. The chains are a little bit wrapped up, but that's an interesting configuration of things. We will do that for five. What have we here? It looks like a snood. A beaded snood? Seriously? What the hell? Or what? Or a beaded, um, it might be a beaded, like a lampshade type thing. Because there's the top. And the rest of these, the netting, and it's like, hard to explain, but the bottom part is, let me get it, the bottom heart part is like scalloped like that, 
So it's I think it's meant to go over a um, over a little lampshade. And it's all red glass, very pretty. So that I'm gonna do for seven. You might have just a lamp for that. This is pretty. It's a Greek key around the outside of a dyed um, magnesite on a mesh chain. We'll do that for two. Do, 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 black shell. Wait. Jet. Real jet, looks like. And cut shell and a little tiny shark tooth. Little tiny shark tooth. Look at that. Maybe baby one. Do that for two. This one is black metal with black glass. Three for that. Ooh, you're pretty. And you're missing something. Hmm. It had something uh, attached to it. very pretty it's got nice agate undyed agate it's got blue fire polish it's got ooh dyed blue agate excuse me it's got some really sparkly faceted ones and then up here it's got me eh. hmm i wonder what was on there if i find a pendant i'll let you know so that one i'm gonna do just for the beads we'll do it for four if i find the other thing in here i'll let you know this is One of these guys. It's all faux. Made to look like one of those Pandora things or it's a uh, European charms or European, I forget what they call those. I'll do that for three. Oh, we're at 22 again. I keep doing that. <laughs> Uh, I would like to thank you for all for being here. Please leave a like, subscribe if you haven't already, leave a comment in the down there. And remember that I love each and every one of you and be yourself because everyone else is taken. Bye bye.